from With Ace Appliance in Toledo, Ohio, and welcome back to another in-home diagnostic video brought to you by appliancevideo.com. All right, we're on a Maytag dishwasher that's having some issues opening and closing, and what we notice is that the, the handle is loose in there. Now there's a, a rod and a, a spring in there that might be uh, damaged, so we're gonna open it up and take a look at it and see if we can't just adjust it or if it needs to be replaced. The tools you'll need for this repair are a T20 Torx bit and a socket for hand loosening and tightening. All right, so we're gonna access the latch and handle assembly. Uh, it's important on the control panel part where these mounting bolts go in. It's all plastic right here. So hand doing it, loosening them by hand will save you from breaking the, the parts where they mount and having to replace your control panel or having a loose one when you're finished. So we'll just hand loosen these and get them started. All the ones down here go into metal so they're not a problem. And on this model, these are all the same size screws, so makes it a little easier. So now that we have all of those off, we can lift up on our inner panel and check out the handle and latch assembly. All right, so upon inspecting the handle and latch assembly, we can see that uh, the handle is actually broken and there's a part of the uh, latch assembly that's broken. You can get it as all one assembly anyway and it comes with new switches, so that, that's really the, the best way to approach this repair. All right, well, we had to order our latch assembly, so we will return with that and complete the repair. Right now we're just buttoning it back up so that it looks presentable until we get back. Now, when you're reinstalling the, the ones on top here, uh, just continue to be aware that they're plastic and if you torque them too much, You'll break the plastic and this will be loose and or you'll have to replace it. Thank you for watching another in-home diagnostic video brought to you by appliancevideo.com.